Hey guys, it's Ryan. Welcome back to our channel. So today is our first moving vlog. There are going to be a couple of these videos going up, but today Maria and I need to pack our old apartment up and get ready to move into our new house. So I hope you enjoy this video. If you do, please leave a thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe and without further ado, let's get into it. Right, so Maria's over there. Oh, hi everyone. I didn't see you there. What are you doing, Maria? I'm just packing our food. Anything that we can save and take to the new house, we will. Yeah, so that will mostly be things like tinned food, soup, stuff like that. And the reason that we're actually moving is because Maria and I are having a baby, so we need a bigger house. And also, Maria and I don't live together at the moment, but when he's born, we'd like to. So that's kind of the reason, if you guys didn't know. And here he is. He's getting so big, isn't he? He really is. It's so amazing. And also, in the new house, Amy and Amelia will have their own bedrooms, won't they? Yeah, so my two daughters, Amy and Amelia, who are from my previous marriage will also have their own rooms which i think they're really excited about amina's in the bedroom right now and she's packing so you'll see her very soon amy's with jess because she can't really help much with the packing she's only two but anyway that's kind of the situation but over here i've just emptied off this entire cabinet this used to have all our like lamps and things on it but it's moved over into the box which is now down here because obviously we're not going to need any of that stuff until we move out. We don't actually move out for a few days yet, but that stuff's kind of not essential. So probably my next step is to put some of my clothes into my suitcase that I know I won't wear between now and moving. Wow, I never realised I had so many clothes. Wow, your wardrobe's overflowed. I think you have more clothes than me. Maybe we could take some of them to charity, Ryan, if you don't wear them anymore. Hmm. You know what, Maria? That's not a bad idea because my suitcase is kind of full right now. Daddy, daddy, daddy. Oh, hey, baby. Are you okay? I'm okay, but I need some help deciding what to take with me to the new bedroom and what I don't need anymore for charity. Oh, I'm a little busy right now. My suitcase is kind of overflowing. Yeah, you have a lot of clothes. I do, and I think I'm going to take some to charity myself. I need help, though. Why don't you ask Maria? Why? I'm sure Maria would love to help. Maria? Yes, Ryan? Are you busy at the moment? Not really. I've nearly finished organising the food. What's wrong? Nothing. It's just Amelia needs some help deciding what to take to the new place. Maybe you could help her. You're a girl. You know more about girls' toys than me. Sure. Is that okay with you, Amelia? Sure. I guess it is. Come on, then. Oh, I'm so excited. This is a positive sign. Maybe she's coming round to me. Oh, I hope so. Yes, and I hope so, too. Now, let's try and sort this lot out. Look, Maria, there's so much here. I'm not sure what to take with me. Well, if you're not sure, Amelia, I think the best thing to do is to pick out the things that you know you definitely would like to keep. And then we can make one pile for keep, one pile for charity, and one pile for putting in the bin. Okay. Okay, that sounds like a good idea. Cool. So first pick out the toys that are either brand new or that you played with recently. Uh, okay. So let's see what I've got. Uh, okay, so we have my Jojo bow, that's new, so I'll keep it. And my Rainbow Corn, because that's still in box. Excellent, this is the easiest way to work out what you're going to keep. Okay, I know I definitely want these two. Right guys, so I've actually finished organising my clothes. I'm so happy about this. It's so hard to decide what you're going to keep and what you're not going to keep. But it looks much better now, so I've managed to fit everything in this suitcase. And then down here is this bag, and this is what we're going to use to take things to charity. Because Amelia's also getting things ready for that as well, so that should be good. And I think I'm now going to have a break and make me and Maria a drink and Amelia as well. So I hope the girls are getting on as well as I have. 
and on here is the rest of my stuff so i definitely need to keep my barbie and my fidgets because they're my favorite toys that i've had for a long time those are so cool i used to like barbies when i was a little girl too really how many did you have i had quite a few at my parents house if we still have them in the loft maybe i could give them to you and amy oh that would be lovely thank you maria you're welcome, sweetheart. So put those in the box for keeping then. There, that's the pile for keeping. This is something that I should give to charity because I'm too big for it now and so is Amy. It's really cute though, isn't it? I think it's adorable. Oh, okay, Amelia. I was just thinking maybe we could keep it for your little brother. No, I don't want to keep it for him. It was mine and Amy's, not his, and anyway, it's pink. But maybe he would like it. No, it's not for him. I would rather give it to Charity. I don't want to talk about him. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. Thank you. Right, let's put that in the Charity pile. And I think we're finished. We should tell Daddy. Of course, Amelia. I'll go do that now. Mmm, Ryan, that looks good. Oh, I'm just making everyone some juice. I figured everyone will be thirsty after all the hard work. I finished sorting out my entire suitcase. How did you and Amelia get on? Well, she's decided what she wants to keep and what she wants to get rid of. I said that maybe we could keep some of the babyish toys for the new baby, but she didn't want to talk about him, so I just left it. Yeah, she still needs more time to adapt to that. She hasn't accepted it yet. I know, Ryan, but she's got some good things there, and it went really well. It was great to spend some time with her. She's really cute. Well, I'll go and have a look and see what she's done, and then we can all have a drink. Amelia! Amelia! Yes, Dad? Maria tells me you've organised everything. Yes, I've emptied my shelves. This box is for keeping, and this pile down here is for charity. Well, it all looks very organised. I'll take everything to the charity shop in the morning. Okay. And now would you like to come out and have some drinks? Sure. Maria told me that you got on really well with her today. Yeah, it was awesome. I enjoyed sticking my toys out with her. I'm glad that you enjoyed that, baby. And I'm glad that you're starting to get used to Maria slowly. Maybe a little bit, but I don't like the baby. It's okay. It's normal for it to take time. Are you going to come out and have something to drink before we set off? Yeah. Come on then. Jess, I figured I should bring Amelia back. Oh, that's wonderful. Hello, Amy. How are you, sweetheart? Amy, good daddy. I'm excited to see my new bedroom. Well, that's exciting. I hope you like it. Oh, my new daddy here. Daddy, hello. Oh, hi, Amelia. Are you talking to me? Yeah, you're Luke, my new daddy, aren't you? I love you as much as daddy, or maybe more. Oh, thank you, Amelia. It's lovely to see you. Let me give you a hug. Hang on a minute. Did you just say daddy, Amelia? He's not your dad. I am. Oh, no. Ryan, please don't start. Hang on a minute, she just said that she loves Luke more than me and that Luke's her new dad. That's not right, Amelia. I'm daddy, remember? Yes, but Luke is my new daddy and I like him a lot as well because he is a nice man and a good daddy for me and Amy. But what about me? I'm your real daddy. I know that and I love you, but I don't like your new baby. But I do love Luke. Daddy, I don't want to make you sad, but I like Luke as well. He's my new dad. It's okay, Amelia. It's just upsetting for me. But I'll see you soon, okay? Yeah, okay, Daddy. I'll see you soon. <laughs> Amelia, I think you and I need to have some words. Why, Mummy? What did I do? I know you're a little bit upset and I know you're a little bit confused, but... I think you might have really upset Daddy by what you said about Luke. Why? I was nice about Luke and I just told the truth. 
I know you were nice about Luke, but you didn't need to say I love Luke more than you right in front of Daddy's face. It probably made him feel sad and that wasn't nice. I didn't mean to upset him, but I was just saying that I love Luke a lot. I know, but I think you need to think about what you say sometime. It's okay. I'll go after him and make sure that he's okay. Try and calm the situation a bit. Okay, Luke, but please don't let things get too heated. I'll try not to, and I'll see you soon. Brian! Brian!